Hi, welcome to the attic. For those who don't know who I am, my name is Kai. I got a little assistance today. Give me a second and we will see. Ooh, I got a cameraman. <laughs> Say hi. Hi. <laughs> welcome, Gisla. Thank you. Today, we're going to have a look at uh, what I told earlier about this. Uh, what, what did you call it? Was it the uh, isolating transformer? Come, let's have a look. Okay, have we got it? The big <coughs> heavy box. Um, I don't know the weight for it. It is heavy. Just trust me. Uh, what I do with this one is that I have the possibility to power up electronics and uh, can avoid to get a shock, an electric shock. And I'm, I'm, go I'm going to show you why. Uh, what is also a little fun about this one is it is very uh, variable, so I can decide myself how much power I want, if I want only 5 volt uh, AC or if I want 230 volt AC. But let's now try to understand why I'm using this and how can it be able to avoid me to get shocked when, uh, when powering up. Come here, let's see here, I have something here. We all know what these are. Uh, the, the, it's is it inlet or is it outlet? Outlet? Yeah. We call it outlet. Plug. A plug. Yeah. Can we have also bring this multimeter so we can see what to be. Do we have any electricity in this? There. Okay. Here we have 230 something volt AC. And I'm going to let one stay there. Because no, I can take them out. <laughs> we also have, you see, this one there. It's a funny little thing. It is what we call ground. So, if we measure, oh, I need both. So, if you measure between this face and ground, then see it is half, ah, a little more than half. Oh my, come on. It's around half, half the voltage. And also, I have this grounded plate here. Also, if I measure from that outlet to this ground, I also have the same. And this, this mat, this plate represents the ground we are walking so uh, and that is to avoid uh, if if there's any ground issues and so on you can, uh, can avoid to, to get electrify, uh, electrified or you can also avoid uh, static electricity which is crucial uh, when handling electronics but what is it it is very <laughs> It is very nice. It's okay to have this ground because if it has uh, an issue with uh, with uh, the ground pl uh, plan or if it has some some issues with some uh, uh, some units, whatever, 
then you don't get electricity. Uh, you don't get shocked because that electricity goes to the, uh, goes to ground. That is the benefits from it. Uh, but the cons <laughs> um, is that if you touch back to this one. Oh, this one is kind of impossible to open, but if you touch one of these, then you then you get shocked because you are the connection between ground and this and ground and this. So then you get you get shocked, and that that is the real problem when working on electronics is that you all, always have this electricity, and you can. Unluckily, getting contact with one of these phase. So what we do then? Can we use this box? Okay. Let's see then if it was correct. Not to kill anyone. Let's. Try 100 volt first. We have voltage. We have black one on ground and 110. Well, that was kind of fun. This one is uh, meant to be a variable um, isolating transformer. What it appeared to be is a variable transformer. Uh, what I find very curious is that this ground level is it's not gone it's supposed to be gone so what it means it's if this one has been a isolating transformer then I could put my finger in one of the holes and nothing will happen and this one if I put my finger in one of this uh, one of these holes I get a shock which is not the purpose of this at all. I wonder, is it something wrong I do, or is it something wrong with that transformer? That I, that I have to check. But anyway, we have come to, as long as I can see, at the end of this video. Then uh, we all know what to do. We have this, you know, down there, this uh, ticks, this click, uh, this like and subscribe buttons. Click them; it's free. And also click this notification bell and get the notification next time we post a video. So uh, until next time, what do you say, Gisla? See you. Bye. Bye. <laughs>